What is going on guys? Kevin Rose Rose coming back at you with another video today. We are getting back into figures. I know everybody wanted figures, figures, figures. So I'm going to film a ton of videos today. I just filmed the last one of Star Wars. We're going to switch it up here and go right into some superheroes. This lot I did pay about $200 for, I believe. About a pound and a half of superheroes. So let's take a look and see what we got. Um, I'm coming back into the, uh, the figure naming <laughs> world after being I've gone for a while with doing all those huge, enormous set collections and whatnot. So it's always hard on the brain to try to remember all of these things. So go easy on me if I butcher some of these. I do apologize to the hardcore superhero fans out there. If you guys do see any of this stuff that you like, stores.ebay.com slash legbros is where you can find it. Uh, let's go ahead and dive in. Comment below what your favorite one is. Of course, I will respond to those. I do have to respond to comments too. <laughs> That's something I have been ignoring. So I do apologize. We'll get back into that. Don't worry, guys. It will happen. Uh, this is a big fig uh, of the Green Goblin. Unfortunately, this big fig is probably the least valuable big fig there ever was made. Uh, so that's unfortunate, <laughs> but uh, that's okay. Uh, Hulk, tan pants Hulk, fantastic. 15, 20 bucks right there. No problem. We have a keychain, brand new keychain actually, uh, in the Wonder Woman form here. Uh, let's see what else we got here. <laughs> we have the Pizza Guy Spider-Man. Pizza Delivery Spider-Man. I mean, that's fantastic. Love the look. It totally matches. <laughs> it totally goes. Fantastic head, though. That's one of my favorite Spider-Man uh, forms of all time. It's the older one, um, the light blue or dark blue. So maybe we have the torso in here as well. That is a fantastic head condition, though. A lot of times the back webbing will be broken, and you can see this is nearly mint, uh, if not mint. So Fantastic. I will use that in a heartbeat. Unfortunately, we're going to disassemble Pizza Guy, Spider-Man, and we'll put that down here. Uh, we, of course, have Man Bat, because what's a superhero haul without Man Bat? Um, we do have Black Panther. Rip, that might be Kill... No, I think that's Black Panther. Killmonger's yellow eyes, I believe. Uh, we... <laughs> what gives it away that they're magnets? <laughs> uh, unfortunately... We have some magnets in here. These would have been fantastic figures. Sometimes when you find superhero lots and you see these, uh, I always jump at them because I'm like, old Joker, old Robin, awesome. Yeah, I want to get those. Uh, unfortunately, a lot of times they're the magnet versions, which are definitely not as valuable. So still have some value. We'll still make them up and uh, sell them. Usually I sell them in magnet packs because that's how they came in. Um, but we'll just put these down here because they are cool figures uh, in terms of like the time period they came from and whatnot. We do have Venom with his spines on the back there. Not particularly awesome. Uh, Iron Man. We know where Iron Man goes, right? Always, 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 always. Uh, here's kind of a big fig uh, Junior's form of one of my favorite builds of Spider-Man. Same type of headpiece there, which is actually kind of cool. <laughs> I don't know if I've gotten that one before, but that's obviously a Junior set or something to that effect. Um, kind of like a Jack Stone size figure. We got Batman in the house. As always, Batman is Batman. Hulk with the purple pants with decoration. He's not quite as valuable. He doesn't have any arms, so we're not going to put him in the valuable pile. We do have Shazam in the house. Really, really cool movie. I just saw that recently on a plane. Uh, <laughs> I hadn't seen it, in, and so I, I believe that's what this one is, Shazam. I don't think he's tremendously valuable. I think he was in a poly bag. I could be wrong. I could be wrong on that one. I haven't looked into minifigure values lately, uh, so could be wrong on that one. Short Cape Robin, the new version. Uh, we do have the Bat Dog, which is kind of fun. Not super valuable, I don't believe, but fun nonetheless. Uh, another Batman. We got Catwoman, Harley Quinn in the house, and Harley Quinn's hammer, it looks like. Not sure if that's the version that goes with it or not. Uh, we do have the Black Suit Spider-Man. I was looking for this. Man, we had an inventory mistake, and we couldn't find one of the Black Suit Spider-Man builds, and I was looking everywhere. I looked, I went through all of these lots, um, like just poured them out looking for one particular fig that I had, and uh, just to see if I could ship them out, and I had to cancel the order. And then the first superheroes thing that I go through, there he is. I still don't know where the other one went. I mean, inventory mistakes can happen, but uh, very rare. Black Suit Spider-Man, I'm going to put him right here because uh, that ticks me off. <laughs> I should put him in the garbage because it ticks me off, but you know, uh, he's still worth 10 bucks or so. Uh, Batman, nothing there, uh, nothing there, Iron Man, we know where Iron Man goes. This one is cool, this is the newer version of Poison Ivy, really, really like that decorated version, the hairpiece is awesome, she does have the skirt there as well, one of my favorite versions, probably my favorite version of um, Poison Ivy. We do have Bruce Wayne here as well with his little bow tie, that's actually a pretty good fig, I believe, 
Ooh. Haven't sold it in a while. Uh, old school version of Two-Face. And this one actually is not a magnet. So that's kind of cool. We have plenty of headpieces to put with him. So that will be a fantastic ting there as well. If we don't find a headpiece, that'll be fine. We can, uh, we can do that. Nothing there. Uh, we do have Mary Jane. I think that's a good one too. Uh, maybe not. I don't remember. I really don't remember on that one. We're going to put that kind of in the middle right there. Because I don't remember. Could be good, could be not. Outrider, terrible value. Uh, Iron Man always goes down there. We've got the twins here. I usually sell them together. Uh, Commissioner Gordon from series, I believe, is what that one was. Batman fan. There's another man bat, of course. Newer version of Wonder Woman. Those always sell fantastic. So no worries there selling that. A decorated version of Spider-Man. Decorated arm version. Not super valuable yet. I think later on they probably will be, though. Uh, Superman, and we had Nightwing there. This is one of the Aquaman set figs, I think. I don't remember what her value was. I haven't gotten that one very often, so I don't. I can't think of the value offhand. Uh, there's another different version of uh, Poison Ivy's hairpiece. Another updated hairpiece, but different than the last one. Uh, Two-tone leg Batman. Interesting. Uh, okay, here we go. There's one of the uh, one of the Spider-Man versions that I like. I can't decide if I like the dark blue or the light blue better. Um, but yeah, there he is. Fantastic. They made it best the first. <laughs> it's crazy how sometimes that happens. All the future iterations are worse than the original. There's a Doc Ock in his probably his worst form right there, uh, unfortunately. But what can you do? Iron Man. Uh, ooh, here's another Joker. The original Joker. Man, he is dusty. Uh, but usually dusty's good because that means I didn't play with him. <laughs> uh, so I'll clean off dust. Uh, he even has his little bang pew pew thing there as well. Fantastic figure right there. That's going to be 40 bucks if I can find the hair piece. That's really going to be the, uh, the difference maker here. The equalizer is finding the old hair piece of that guy. Uh, the newer version of Thor here. One of the newer versions. Uh, there's another Wonder Woman. Oh, here we go. Here's the CW version of Flash, I believe is what that one is. Uh, that's fantastic. The newer updated versions people prefer to the old ones. The old one used to be worth like 20 bucks. Now it's worth like 7 to 10, I believe. A whole bunch of capes in here. There's Harley Quinn. Another keychain. Uh, Batman. Here's the original um, Mr. Freeze head, but it's torn up. Unfortunate. Uh, unfortunate. It goes along with the uh, Inquisitor that was torn up. Uh, here's another, the uh, one of the original versions of Batman. Unfortunately, his bat... Oh, it's just dust. Okay. <laughs> uh, $15 figure right there as well. He goes with the Joker or the Two-Face. Two I don't remember which one went with which. Uh, the gold filigree version of Batman, which is probably in here too, I would imagine, uh, goes with one of them, and then that one goes with the other in their original forms. Here's Bucky, the Winter Soldier. Fantastic. Keep that one uh, for the Ting Pile. Iron Man pieces go with Iron Man. Two-tone leg Superman. Nothing there. Just some accessories, accessories, accessories. Short Cape Robin. Kind of a unique one. Uh, what else am I seeing here? I have to take a seat for the next video. My back's hurting. <laughs> Bending over. This desk is pretty short. Uh, there's another version of that same Batman, which I thought I was going to find the other one, but uh, I'll take it. I'll take it. I don't think either of these were magnets. Maybe one of them was. I don't know. War Machine. Fantastic. 30 bucks once we make him up. Or 20 bucks. That one's 20 bucks, I think, uh, at the moment. Don't see, unfortunately, any of the Joker hairs. We had two Jokers, so I was hoping to at least use the hair of the magnet, too. Um... Because those hairs are actually pretty expensive to try to get. Uh, one of my favorite minifigure or superhero minifigures, we had Deathstroke here. He sells pretty instantaneously because he's a lot of people's favorites. Razal Ghoul, that's a good one to find as well. I think he's 20, 25 to 30 bucks uh, as well. Uh, and then we, ooh, all right, Gamora. Interesting. Actually, Gamora can, Gamora can probably go down here. I think all of the Guardians have been pretty good lately. I think this is Deathstroke's leg piece. Looks about right. It's either that or um, Hobgoblin. 
always get those two legs mi mixed up. Uh, let's see if there's anything else that rings out to us. Otherwise, it looks like we're pretty done. There's another Iron Man. Vulture. Uh, ooh, there's a Deadpool torso. I don't see the rest of Deadpool in here, but it might be. Deadpool torso. As long as it's not cracked, we should be able to use that. And it's not. Fantastic. Be able to use that, no problem. Him and Deathstroke. Um, probably two, two favorites there. Uh, oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. Fantastic. He's gone up quite a bit in value, actually, the original form of Two-Face. Um, good to see. I love those old original superheroes. Probably all of my favorite, besides the Poison Ivy, uh, probably all my favorite versions were the originals, actually. Um, the old Balaclava Spider-Man's awesome, but these Spider-Man versions are some of my favorite as well. The dark blue and light blue there. Uh, the Batman's favorite versions, Two-Face favorite version, Joker's favorite version, Robin, this, the wavy hair Robin, uh, looks cool and uh, also valuable. There we go. That's the Batman I was thinking about, the gold version. That came with either Two-Face or Joker. I'm not sure which one originally. There's another War Machine. Usable pieces all over the place. Uh, we have the Super Dog. I don't remember his name. Uh, what is his name? Comment below if you remember his name. <laughs> I don't remember. Uh, there's another Robin. Awesome. Awesome. We'll use all these parts, no problem. I think that's about it in terms of the interesting things in here. The rest are just kind of meh. Uh, they're not really anything super valuable, um, but uh, not bad at all. Ooh, there's a cool piece. That's uh, Mantis from Guardians of the Galaxy. Maybe her body's in here too. I'll have to see because that's actually a good fig uh, if we can find the rest of her. That will be fantastic. Another War Machine. That War Machine's coming out of my ears. Uh, not a bad problem. Not a bad problem. All right, comment below. Also, uh, what else were we... Were, what, oh, his name. His name. Comment below his name as well. It's a Tron fig. Those are actually pretty popular, too. Uh, comment below what your favorite one was. Share the video. If you enjoy the figure videos, show me some love. Smash that like button. Uh, get this over through the YouTube algorithm, get our channel back on track because we're kind of fading with all the set videos. So I do apologize. Obviously you guys wanted fake videos, so we're back. <laughs> I have like 50 boxes of fake videos to film. So, uh, you know, I got plenty of content. It's just a matter of time of doing it. So I got some time today. I'm gonna film a whole bunch of videos uh, on the same day. So uh, probably see the same setup and everything, but uh, I love you guys. I missed you and I'll catch you on the next one.